Come on, big tank. You are holding us up. What the hell? His massive truck has been in the way the whole time, all through them twisties, and now he turns. Damn you. Well, guys, finally. Finally going for a moto camp, hey, and I've been wanting to do this for such a long time ever since like the around the backyard tour It's been damn ages. So we're here We're waiting for a ferry to cross the, the lake and then we're like half an hour away from our Destination our camping destination, which is Mill Creek. It's like two hours north of Sydney. I'm waiting for a friend though I've got a friend coming with me. She's we we actually toured together for the illusionist 1903 we went to Dubai and all the Middle East and everything, then toured Australia, it was sick. The first time we met and uh, now we're like the best mates, now we're like family. So she's taking along, she loves the camp, she loves the hike. Cheating a little bit, like I've got my packs and everything behind me, I don't think you can see it. Packs are all there, she's bringing some chairs and all the cooking stuff. Like, I don't care. She's driving, let her bring all the heavy stuff. How's it going mate? <laughs> How are ya? This is Emma, say hello. Hello. Which one were we at? Back there? I'll follow you. We did not know which campsite is ours. So it's not like crazy, you know, crazy, crazy camping like we were doing around the backyard and stuff. This is actually so much nicer though. The air is cool. It's autumn. It's cooling down a lot, which is sweet. Suss this bad boy out, eh? So yeah, no cars, but <laughs> lel. I'm pretty sure this is us. 30, 29. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. How sick is this? This is awesome. Okay, we're looking at where do I put the tents? The old question. Nice flat ground. We're here. here yeah. And do you want to like, do you want to face each other? <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> Morning. Neighbors. Hello. Hello. Just the softening of the ground. <laughs> is that what we're doing? Pretty soft. <laughs> Mozzie is hectic. There are mozzies. I've already, yeah, I already got smashed like twice. Oh. And I'm not usually one that gets bitten either. I have Aerogard in it. Aerogard. Have a bloody good weekend. This is what I packed. Two bags, two of the Uso bags. Yeah, we're only just staying one night. We got all this as well. <laughs> Emma's just like, what the hell? <laughs> we camp in style. <laughs> yeah, two bags, two of the Uso dry packs. Way less than last time. Look at all the mozzies, man. There's actually so many mozzies. Are there? Yeah. Shit. There's actually heaps. I will show you what's inside of them, but that's it. And like, you know, the four clips. And then the front there as well. And um, that was it, man. Heaps easy setup. It actually felt so weird as compared to the around the backyard tour, where I had just heaps of stuff everywhere. It was chaos all the time. It's a simple, simple ride, simple day, and a, a more simple friend. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Okay, so this is like, this is all I packed, and it's just like necessities. So it looks like, it might have looked like it's a lot. Did you think I had a lot of stuff for tonight? No. No? Look at Rob. Look yeah, at I know. Rob. Yeah, I know a lot of stuff. And literally that's mine. So yeah, in the small bag, I just had like, you know, my camera stuff. I've got it all in here. Like, got a drain in there. It's extra batteries and GoPros and stuff. That's my main like camping bag thing with all the tools, cutlery. Got some winter gloves just in case it was really cold this morning, which it wasn't, but I just had them. Got my zoom recorder. So on the way home, I'm going to get some tasty pipe action sound and that's what I use to record all my sounds for my bike when I do those mad little blips yeah and that's it for that bag so it's mainly like camera gear and just camping ish gear and then this one this sleeping bag took up most of space and I've got my mat uh, I've got my tent there um, hiking boots and then my thermals and some clothes there I've got a detailed vid on five camping essentials I'll link it here go and check it out if you're keen to see some more in-depth stuff about all this gear that I just mentioned all right setup time my arms is getting smashed by mozzies that's damn, that's damn scary. Yes. Yes. There we go, baby. 
Uh, she has literally she has like all the <laughs> the top class stuff. I'm about to blow up my pillow. This thing was two dollars and hers was like fifty bucks or something. I think when it comes to blow up pillows, there's like they're pretty similar. Oh yeah. But she's got a nice like soft. Uh, see, I put a t-shirt over mine. <laughs> I got the hard plasticky parts. I just dig into your neck. Wow. Yeah. Sounds really <laughs> comfy, Rob. <laughs> These are my plates. Okay. Classical. They're still, these were like 10 bucks or something. I like them. Like They're all foldy, floppy boys. <laughs> Cup, bowl, plate. Clapsible. Do you want to see what I brought? <laughs> yeah, let's see. Bring it. Um, I brought a full picnic set. Oh, I've got these matches plates, matches for the fire, Soup? cups, Ooh, cashews. Oh, nuts. Oh man, how's it? It's a picnic bag. Yeah, Holy it's crap. a full. Some tea. How's the little wine glasses? Yeah. <laughs> How good's that? She's prepared. I reckon. She's prepared. I got some Anzac biscuits because it was Anzac Day. So good. But I do have a good solid head torch, the Black, ah, Diamond, Black Diamond. And it's with the high yes. beam, the high beam boy. It didn't spare no expense on this bad boy. No, you redeemed yourself. Man, you need a good head torch. I think a head torch is the one thing that has to actually be good because you want to see. Seeing is, you know, believing. seeing is believing. I'm a Ford, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> okay, so my mattress is not pumping up. Usually it just air, like it goes up by itself. I feel like maybe I should have had it not rolled up the entire time, like between camping trips. <laughs> it just needs to like undo itself a little bit more, you know? Okay, so 11 kilometers, four and a half hours. Let's go. No. Now we're going to do the, uh, the tiny little one. <laughs> the grass tree circuit. <laughs> I mean, we would have. Oh, we would have done it, but it's, it's closed. The 11k oh, one's closed. No. Yeah. Because it's probably going to be something. Gonna like a damn brown side will kill you in kill three you. seconds. Yeah. And then when I went to the US, they have like squirrels and chipmunks and stuff. So every time there would be a squirrel, I'd just be walking along, there'd be a squirrel. I'd just be like, <laughs> get ready to go. <laughs> every time. Because I'm like, it's a fucking brown steak. Yeah, that's right. I'm just like always on the lookout. <laughs> Got me. And then like, I always feel that when, when you go overseas, you sort of are a bit more chilled out as well. Like yeah. just thinking like, holy crap, there's like not that much that, that's small that can kill me here. Yeah. Like what we do, like you always like checking things like white tip spiders, man. Oh, if God. they're like everywhere, they're around the house and stuff. Yeah. If they bite you, like they eat other spiders. So then they carry the bacteria and the venom and stuff. So it just eats away your skin, man. Yeah. <laughs> and you can't feel their bite apparently. It's like a mosquito. Yeah. How good's that? Why does everything <laughs> Why does everything suck, man? <laughs> you guys have it damn easy. Yeah. <laughs> Non-Aussies. I mean, you have bears and you have bears <laughs> Cougars, yeah, fully. Oh yeah, I think I'd rather a brown snake. Yeah. Well, like, imagine right, okay, right now. We say, through there, you just hear something snap or whatever, and you're in the US or something. And then you see there's like a brown bear or some crap. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, imagine that, you no, just... you'd be dead. Yeah, you'd be done to you. You'd be done. And, but like the fear of being chased down and crushing your bones. That's the thing, they chase you. Oh no, thank you. Nuh-uh, nuh-uh. Yeah, you're right, I don't want that. <laughs> Not for me. This is very pretty though, hey? Yes. Yeah, this is Jurassic Park vibes. Oh no. See a Velociraptor get up now. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll take brown snakes. <laughs> I'll deal with them. What you doing? I'm about to light the bloody fire. So we're all decked out, we're all wintered up now. I went for a mad little explore, took the bike out for a little spin. Emma just chilled in Zen. Literally chilled. Had some, um. It's, cold. <laughs> it's pretty cold. I'm dying. The bush turkeys came around. 
I had so a confrontation. Yeah, it was pretty hectic. You can it tell was, me about it. What it happened? It was a lot. Well, I was just getting changed into my thermals in my tent, and suddenly there's a lot of noise happening. I don't know what's going on. I'm thinking this guy that's camped over there is uh, coming to steal our firewood or something. <laughs> our dip. <laughs> our dip. And I come out and the bush turkey's just laying into our dip and crackers. And I had to run out and scare the shit out of it. <laughs> Which they're not so scared, hey? They're not scared. They're just they're brave little mofos, man. They don't care. Australia. Australia. We don't have cougars or bears. We do have bush turkeys, though. <laughs> Does any other place have bush turkeys? If you have bush turkeys, drop us a comment. I want to know. Because <laughs> they're, you know, they're cheeky little buggers. Um, anyway, so we're going to start. We're going to get this fire cranking. We're going to cook some food. I've got some sausages. I'm going to cook those little bad boys. What have you got? You're making like a Mexican... Like a chili vibe. We're How good is that? It. Chili. And then, yeah, then we're just going to... It's literally like, what time is it? 5.30? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like it's just damn like near midnight. Get it, Emma. Get it. Yeah, it's come on. Working. Come on. I don't know how old these matches are. Do matches oh, have... good. Okay, this is doing well. Uh, <laughs> I have three boxes, so oh, chances yeah, you do. are you actually do. one of them is going to work. <laughs> I don't know how... Is it? Have a crack? You know this what? Like a professional okay. match, match starter. Okay. But I think the, is it the box that's ruined, I think? Mean. Yeah, I, I think it might be the box. Oh. I snapped that in there. Professional. There we go. Oh, okay, well. I'll take it back. Uh, I need more of them. Oh, they're in the box. <laughs> wow. I need more matches. Where are they? Yeah. Really nice morning. Woke up to uh, the bloody bush turkeys, man. They absolutely, as expected, I, you know, had a feeling. Look at this mess here. So it was going for that. It was just munching on that. The yeah, disgusting. Out of our rubbish bag. Broke through the bag, man. Like, <laughs> look at this. So yeah, and then like old mate down the end there, he was, he was like the exact same thing. It's like fuck. In bush turkeys. <laughs> Other than that, I slept like a damn baby. But it was just that, yeah, just the just the damn bush turkeys and the and the um the other ones. What was the other one? The crows. Wow. <laughs> it's, there's still people down there. <laughs> Alrighty, the Lord of Fire is ready. So check this out, old Billy Styles on the campfire. Yeah. How cool is that? She's gonna make my coffee. Oh. <laughs> Am I? <laughs> she is. <laughs> okay. Camping Rob. Camping Rob. I accept. That should be very hot. Get all those lumps out. Yeah. The last one wasn't so successful. The well, last one I drank just had a massive lump of powder. I just ate it like a biscuit. <laughs> Organically heated water. Hey. <gasps> I had to drink it. Don't you dare. What? That's awesome. That's all right. It's not too bad, I guess, you know. Mmm, it's coffee, sort of. But it's got chocolate on it, so that's nice. Mm, nice. Thank you, Emma. Welcome. I didn't say you can sit down. Fuck. She's leaving us. But this was fun. Bye, Emma. Bye, love. Bye. See you soon. Yes. Let's do this again. Yes. Okay, it is just us, baby. Me and you, and L Nature. What the hell do I do now? <laughs>